This is the system that we started with a couple of years ago. Very simple. This is the septic outflow ditch from obviously our septic tank. And this is um, a hybrid biomass willow. This is Bowles Hybrid. And we just shoved it in a simple cuttings a couple of years ago and we've just you know kept replicating it every year and now you can see just how much we've got it just gets more and more each year i mean this one here is just this is basically all this material here is a single stick originally just a few years ago and some of it i've actually started weaving in lower down i'm trying to make a very low wall of woven willow to retain material as i dig it out of the ditch you know later on in the season the idea behind this though is there's a slight odor coming off this. It's a septic ditch. There's, you know, it's not a pleasant environment. You know, it's human waste. And it's easy to just be right now, you know, that's done, that's finished, we're finished with that, we'll just let that go and there we go, we'll not worry about it anymore. But the trouble is, that's Loch Watton, that's the biggest loch in Caithness, you know? And there's an awful lot of septics like this that, you know, eventually drain straight into that. So the more that we can clean it up before it gets there, it's a win for us. We get loads of, you know, really nice biomass willow, but also it's cleaning up a problem from a system that was installed by previous generations that didn't really worry about such things. So, yeah, we're going to keep going with it and we're going to keep harvesting year after year. Because, you know, this type of material for us, this is what our house runs on. This is what the, um, the mass heater runs on. It's what our heating runs on. And also, in some, it's windy. In a few years' time, we'll also have other systems that also run on material just like this. You know, very thin, easily processed whips. Willow's amazing. I'll do, I'll do a video at some point. We've got thousands of willow. So, yeah, uh, clearly, you know, we're a fan. So... I'm going to weave a little bit more in as we go, but mostly we're going to harvest it and then uh, we'll see how much we manage to grow on what is effectively a waste resource. So that's that trim for this year. I've still left a lot of thin material left that's going to be woven into that low wall and then I still have to dig it out. That's a job for another day. It's too cold today. I just wanted to get it harvested. But that is a lot of material and really some of the older stuff. I mean, you can see just the thickness of the wood, they're like little trees, you know, it's starting to really, you know, make a big difference. So this lot, by the time it's dried, I reckon would easily be, I don't know, three or four days, maybe three days, also safely three days of heating for the house. And that's not bad considering it's just been a quick, you know, 25 minutes with loppers work. The biggest trouble with this is it takes two person to stop it falling into the septic ditch. But of course, as time passes, it'll be easier to do that, you know, without it going in hopefully. Uh, but even if not, it's a great way of generating really long ones. I mean, some of these are huge. You know, they're like two, two and a half meters long, which I want for another project, but that's for another day. What I'm going to do with these today is I'm going to throw these butt end into the duck pond. So they'll just be sitting there rather than drying out. They'll be sitting in water and uh, yeah, they'll, uh, they'll be fine there for a little while until, you know, I actually get around to doing it. Worst case scenario, they start to root out, which isn't great. But, you know, it shouldn't be too long. Boom, by next week, I'll get onto it. So, yeah, that is this lot done, which will eventually be firewood. But at the moment, we're turning into cuttings to produce even more firewood. We've got thousands of them. Willow's brilliant. So it's a couple of days on, and I've got it all woven in. So you can see, I really like that. I think that's, well, is it right to describe a septic? ditch is pretty but you know i think that's really quite attractive so you can see as it starts to fill out you know that'll get more woven in year to year as the thinner stuff gets woven in also the lower stuff so this year as it starts to really grow and you can see it's starting to bud out already as it starts to really grow all the lower stuff will weave sideways to make like a basket effect so this whole section will be completely fused in eventually so as i come through and i dig the material out of the septic ditch and put it onto the back here it'll seep through and it'll you know really rapidly feed that willow so instead of something being you know a bit of a problem and you know something that's seen as a waste to be gotten rid of it's something that actually becomes a resource something that actually gives us a huge amount of biomass because don't forget every year this willow will produce more and more and more shoots as it becomes more established these are still very very young i mean the, i think the thickest is still thinner than my wrist you know it's not it's not old at all yet whereas you know in five ten years time this will be you know a solid wall of willow it will like come through graze it all straight back you know very very simply remove a huge amount of biomass by then and we could even take half each year and leave the other half so we've got some really you know big shoots coming along for thicker material 
but uh, I'm really pleased with that considering it's a very very new system you see it's a little bit thin here so this year we'll uh, you know as this starts to come up we'll just continue to weave it all in um, and it will be extended further down yet you know we're not completely finished with this um, but before I do any more work on it I need to get all of this rock moved out of the way so that I'm not digging you know, fresh material on top of the stone because this is you know prime building material it's really nice so that's going to get used so yeah really pleased with that that's uh that's a really nice job i'm uh, very very pleased so you can't have too much willow so right that's me done